what's your name? Welcome to black screen. Fading in. Detaching probes. Wings and ascend ascending. Slash Spaceship off. somehow going backwards. Yep, we got a reverse pull. <laughs> and we're going. Well, we basically get shot off into the galaxy with like a gun. Yeah. It's like light speed, but like way harder to understand what the fuck is going on. I think it's like every. I believe Navaria is the place you're talking about. I've just now noticed that the left side of the screen is being cut off. Because the word Novaria was half off the screen. Yeah. Approach yeah. control. This is the SSV normal. Requesting a vector into well, birth. I mean, I guess if it took us this long to notice, it's probably not a big deal. Not scheduled. Our defense grid is armed and tracking. It's state your business. Citadel business. We got a council specter aboard. <laughs> we got a council specter on board. So fuck all of your protocols. Oh, wait, I identification on arrival. Your confirmation cannot be established. Your vessel will be impounded. Uh, no, actually, what you're in bunch. Andromeda. I think I'll take my next leave here. <laughs> so you're nowhere near this. Uh -huh. Oh, that's that's, that's my, the comlink. That's my comlink. PL comlink. That's my comlink. Yeah, that's how you talk to people who uh want to yell at you about shit. No. Don't take that out of context, no. <laughs> no. No. No, go here. You're looking to talk to people. That's good, you should. No. Kaden, no. Yeah, fuck that. No one cares about Kaden, let's be honest. That is, nope. But I will take this. Thank you. <laughs> just. You yeah. just walk into the med bay and steal their fucking medical supplies. Huh! <laughs> Sleeper pods. Not worth my time. Where are my other people? There's one over here. That's here. No, or I just one, I believe. I think there's one here. Where oh, was the first one? Oh, I guess I was wrong. This is my quarters. Personnel manual might tell you where people are, though. No. I might just have to go through the. Might have to go through here. Doctor Chocolates. I actually don't remember where everyone is in this one because uh, it's been a long time since I played it. That and this is the one in which I did not understand that you had to talk to people to actually romance them. Like I just assumed it was naturally going to work into the plot. I didn't know you had to like actively go looking for them. That's Joka. Uh, Try the left side. Yeah, I was about to say. That's actually just a staircase down again, I think. Yeah, you better see. Oh, you know what? It's the elevator. You gotta go in the elevator. No. Yeah. Because... I don't know where everyone is, but I know at least Garrus is down here. Everyone's down here. I bet you that's probably the case. No, like... Everyone's down here. Look at the map. Oh. Yeah. Looks like it. He's wrecked. Uh, nope. <laughs> That's just a requisitions officer. Nope. There's Garrus. Nope. Really? You're not gonna even talk to anyone? Where is my human person? She's uh, back where Rex is. Polly's in this room, though. On the left side. <laughs> Alright. I'm, I'm not becoming you. Okay, you know what? Talking to people does not immediately make you be in a relationship with them. You know that, right? Yes. <laughs> you I'm can talk to people and I'm get to know them real. before you choose. That's just a set of people to put in. There's, there's Commander? Do you have a few minutes to talk? One on one? I'm sorry, Commander. I need to get my duty squared away. <laughs> I wouldn't mind talking more later, though. <laughs> Do you have a few minutes to talk? <laughs> one on one? I'm sorry, Commander. I, need I to get am to your away. Commander. More you will now. listen to me. God damn it. What's your opinion of the last mission? Kinda wish you'd got there sooner, Commander. No offense. I appreciate the rescue. I just wish. 
You wish we'd been able to save the rest of your unit. Yes, ma'am. If I had been more alert, we wouldn't have been cut down by an ambush. The Geth are perfect ambushers. They don't move, they don't make noise, they don't even breathe. They have flashlight heads, ma'am. I'll make sure <laughs> it doesn't happen again. They have Can we now talk? Do minutes to talk? One on one? I'm sorry, Commander. I need to make this <laughs> <talk laughs> way. I, I don't know, maybe you should try talking to someone else don't. instead. Dismissed, Chief. Ma'am. Now I'm calling ma'am. Ma okay. <laughs> Goodbye, person. Goodbye, Ashley. <laughs> oh, I guess I'm gonna go. The ship's on. amazing, Shepard. I've never seen a drive core like this before. I can't believe you were able to fit it into a ship this small. I'm starting to understand why you humans have been so successful. I had no idea Alliance vessels were so advanced. Nothing. In small way. Normandy's a prototype. Cutting edge technology. A month ago, I was patching a makeshift fuel line into a converted tug ship in the flotilla. Now, I'm sitting on board one of the most advanced vessels in Citadel space. I have to thank you again for bringing me along. Traveling on a vessel like this is a dream the come ship? true for me. <laughs> Something just falls over. No idea you found ship technology so interesting. It comes with being a quarian. The migrant fleet is the key to the survival of my people. Ships are our most valuable resource. But we don't have anything like this. We make do with cast-offs and second-hand equipment. <laughs> we just try to keep them running for as long as we can. Some of the fleet's larger vessels date all the way back to our original flight from the Geth. I can't believe your fleet's still using ships that are three centuries old. They're constantly being repaired, modified, and refitted. They aren't pretty, but they work. Mostly. We've tried to make ourselves as independent as possible on the flotilla. Grow our own food, mine, and process our own fuel. But some things we just can't make on our own. A patch to maintain the hull integrity requires raw materials we just don't have. That's why our pilgrimages are so important. I should go. See you later. <laughs> How do you progress the story? Because I don't remember. I really hope I don't go down there. Dude. You may have to go down there just to continue the story. Because I don't know where the exit door is. I think it might be. It's either on the left, way up at the top, or it's downstairs. I think it's on the left, way up at the top. Oh, yeah, see how there's the elevator symbol? I think that's where you're headed. There it is. There's the way off the ship. When I first played this, I had no idea how to do the fucking, how to get off the fucking ship. You told me to keep I was Garrus an with me. I would recommend that. I like Garrus. And he's pretty good at stuff, too. Garrus needs to fuck off. <laughs> I agree with that sentiment. Question is... You're also saying fuck you to, or not, Rex. Yeah. Yeah. I'm also with you there. Who are you gonna take on your mission? Combat, Miss Combat or Miss Tech? <laughs> Garrison's got a little bit of both. Yeah, he's like the middle ground. Mm -hmm. She's like another soldier like me, and then this is like. Kind of, yeah. I mean. Well, she's she's a combat engineer, but she's an engineer. She's smart. She's the smart one. Equalizing interior pressure with exterior oh God, atmosphere. Logged. The commanding officer <laughs> is ashore. Exo Presley has the deck. <laughs>
<laughs> We're gonna zoom in on that face. Oh Exterior. my god, what? <laughs> With that noise. <laughs> run, 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 run. Like your daddy took the Tiber away. What? That's a thing, right? That's far enough. I'm on important business. This is an unscheduled arrival. I need your credentials. <laughs> okay. You first. I didn't With want to encourage you here. to pick it, but Show I like how there was just an option that just said no. <laughs> I'm Captain Michael Matsuo, <laughs> Elanis Risk no. Control Services. All you need to know is I have more credentials than you. They plan to be trouble, man. I can't let you enter the port area without confirmation of your identity. Sergeant Sterling, secure their weapons. Bitch, you can come near me. Bitch, you thought. Back away, nice and slow. Nobody takes my weapon. Charge and lock! We are authorized to use lethal force. You have to the count of three to surrender your weapons. One, two, three. Captain Matsuo, stand down! <laughs> We confirmed their identity. Spectres are authorized to carry weapons here, Captain. You may proceed, Spectre. Get kept. I hope the rest of your visit you will be bitch. less confrontational. Parasini san will meet you upstairs. Behave yourself. <laughs> yeah, uh, hey, this You're one to talk. Fuck you. Fuck you. Oh, how do I fill up on grenades? I didn't do that. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I never used them. I am Gianna Parasini, assistant that to Administrator Analeas. We apologize for the oh, incident that's... in the docking bay. <laughs> Someone pissing your security chief's coffee today? She takes her job seriously. She is a valuable asset to I the company. To One of my seriously. duties is orientation of new arrivals. Do you have any questions? Pretty heavy security for such a small port. The executive board does everything in its power to protect the privacy of our client corporations. Is this privacy intended to hide illegal research? This planet is beyond the jurisdiction of the Citadel. The law is what the executive board says it is. Oof. Do you know how valuable this planet is? How many advances in genetics and artificial intelligence got their start here? Has anyone unusual passed through here recently? Just unusual? An Asari matriarch passed through a few days ago. Lady Benezia. Saren's aid is here. Okay, I, I always had difficulty um, with the options because sometimes they would just change the topic when I didn't want to. But with your character, it just fucking fits. Just like whenever she's sick of talking about it, she's just like, yeah, fuck off. And You're then keep like, going. <laughs> <laughs> I like your character. <laughs> She's a threat to galactic peace. I'm here to bring her in or put her down. Oof. The board doesn't like having outside problems dumped in its lap, Commander. Benezia left for the Peak 15 research complex days ago. To the best of my knowledge, she's still there. Good. Give us directions and we'll be on our way. You'll need to ask Administrator Analeas for clearance to leave this port. Where can I find the Administrator? His office is on the main level, left at the top of the elevator. I pissed her Understood. off. Understood. Can we go <laughs> in now? Of course. If you need any help, you can ask me at the administrator's office. Runs out of the room. <laughs> Fire until you overheat. <laughs> you were just doing the, like, crouching vine cover on her desk. <laughs> Bitch. <laughs> I didn't know you could teabag in this game. <laughs> oh, oh no, please don't tell. No. <laughs> Welcome to Port Hanshan. Yes. The galaxy's most respected site for independent scientific research and development. For your own safety and to protect the privacy of others, to tell you, Lord, you are elevators. required to obey <laughs> any directions given by our security oh, personnel. Still getting good out of here. If you have questions yeah. or concerns, As our friendly time. administrative yeah, staff is us. always available. Thank you, and enjoy your episode. stay. Soon. This one's going to be over soon, but I'll, I'll give it a little bit more time. Hopefully something interesting will happen first. Probably not, though. No, I 
I think they said at the left at the top of the elevator was what they said. Well, that's Why would they have so many windows? Unless I'm wrong. All they see outside is snow. Wrong. Who else? Can't take a walk. Watch your Maybe step they mean this way. Left. Hello. This looks like it might be important. There's two guards outside. And I pass you. Yeah. How oh, yeah. can I help you? I'd like to speak to Analeas. One moment, please. Mr. Analeas? Yes, what, what? Commander Shepard is asking to see you, sir. Wait, this is Fine, come in. Fine, come in. Exact same person I just talked to. Before. Yes, because she just, because remember she said you, if, if you have other questions, you can talk to me at Analeas' office. That's where you are. You will excuse me if I don't stand up. I have no time to entertain refugees from that urban blight called Earth. Oof. Funny thing about humans, we're pretty loyal to our home world. You better show some respect. My homeworld is clean. Poverty is non-existent. If you take some perverse pride in that overheated, acid-washed slum, that is your business. This greeting is a courtesy. I will only cooperate as required by the executive board. Businesses come here to avoid the second guessing of galactic law. <laughs> I'm between these two options right now. You telling me you have no safety protocols? Don't be ridiculous. Do you think a for-profit company would take no precautions against loss of life and material? Project leads have the final say here, not meddlesome politicians. Both of those people are people you're looking for. Heard an Asari matriarch is here. Benezia? She arrived a few days ago, accompanied by a personal escort and some cargo. She's up at peak 15. Can you tell me about her cargo? Large, heavy, and sealed. It passed weapon screening. Beyond that, it is not our concern. What do you mean, personal escort? The phrase is self-explanatory. Bodyguards attending to the safety of her person, mainly Asari commandos. Commandos? You didn't think that odd? They followed all our regulations. I had no reason to forbid Lady Benezia from taking them. What brought her out here? If I knew, I wouldn't be at liberty to say. She came here as Agent Saren's executor. His what? Executor. Saren is a major shareholder in Binary Helix. Lady Benezia is authorized to act in his name. She is here on business for Binary Helix. There were issues at Peak 15 that required Saren's attention. I'd like to see her. Immediately. I'm afraid that you cannot. Peak 15 is a private facility in the Scotty Mountains. Regardless, there is a blizzard in the area. Shuttles are grounded and surface access has been cut off. Back to my other questions. Every minute of my time you waste costs the company 12 credits. I will keep a running tally. Do you do business with Saren? I believe I explained this already, did I not? He is a major investor in well, Binary Helix Corporation, which is one of Novaria's backers. Is Binary Helix developing weapons for him? It's possible, given his interests. What our clients do in their labs is their business. I have no more questions at this time. I received Oof. a dozen urgent messages while you dithered about. Mr. Analeas isn't the only one. You've never worked in the corporate world, have you, Commander? You can't bludgeon through bureaucracy. For a second there, I thought you were going to say I'm going to go fuck your secretary. I can bludgeon pretty hard. Talk to Lorik Keen. You should be able to find him at the hotel bar. Can't say more. Not within earshot of Mr. Analeas. All right. And we'll find out who Lorik Keen is next time. Uh, so stay interesting.